Jewish bread is not mid-strength. Yeah, it is. It's just on special. Whatever, it's mid-strength. Whatever, it's not. I worked it. I know. Well, it is. You're wrong. You have to go. So what's wrong with you? You're sick. How do you know that? You are sick. Contagious? No, not sick. <laughs> Sitting in a letter. What do you need the Medicare number for? I don't. You're making it up. Well, you can just go get your own Medicare number so you fuck that up. <laughs> Fine. There's nothing wrong with me. Even Rocky misses you, eh? Oh, the fucking dog does not miss me. She's getting heck fat now. Dad feeds her. She's been feeding her two-minute noodles every night and bully chickens on the weekends just to reduce. Mum stops and stop it. It's tough for food because she's missing you so much. Wow. I don't believe that. I miss Rocky, does. Did Dad want you to find me? Yeah. I met my man. He's no. Chains, don't be a dick. Yeah, that's right. Criticise me all the time, why don't you? Don't be oversensitive. Are you sensitive? <laughs> Whatever. Crockhead. Shane, come on. You want to get a nap and have a chat? Do we take it? If you want. No, you wouldn't just come in here. You can't just come in here and everything's okay then. You know, practically the whole town's been trying to find you. Do they know what you did to me? Oh, I don't know. Things get down. They should know. Well... Fucking psycho. Anyway, it's not my problem. I don't think you're my brother no more. Mr. Houston died. He had a heart attack watching telly. The go kart track might close now. I reckon I'm allowed to feel how I feel too. I don't reckon there's any reason for me to feel bad about what I've done to anyone. I reckon Tim Houston might get a contract with Maserati, which is fucking bullshit. Look at Martin Luke. He got on the kangaroos and everything, and now he's fat and hopeless. It's just all bullshit. Everything. It's sad Tim's dad died first, but hey. I've wanted to say to ages. I reckon you're a psycho, Ben. No. I got punched in the head outside patches last week. That wasn't last week. Still bruised. Golden got worse. You got me. No, nah, it was one of my mates. Who? Box set done. He was pissed, but we'll make it again now. See? That's what blokes do. Forgive him. Fuck off! Don't tell me what to do! Shane, I'm going through a hard time. You know that. Think about stuff. And I broke up with Bree. When again? Been seeing this girl with Karen. I didn't know that. I went to school with her. She left Golden. No, she's back. She's too young for you. Yeah, I know. And she's a slut. I kind of like her, but I don't know. I just let things get to me sometimes, then. I said you smoke too much pot. No, I don't. You had a billy every day for breakfast. No, Shane. Don't say shit about stuff you don't know about. Who said I had a billy every day for breakfast? You did. You told me that. Pot just makes you forgetful. It doesn't do anything bad. It made you mean. No, it didn't. I don't smoke every day anyway. I don't smoke that much at all. You're full of shit, you are. Something made me into a psycho. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. I used to want to be like you when I grew up. <laughs> Whatever. Fuck you. I said not to come near me. He's going to come back home. No! I've got my hair cut. Do you like it? Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> I heard about uh, Golden a few weeks back. About Rich? Yeah, well... Am I on the still friends with him? No. I mean, yeah. Are they... But is he going to prison? No. He's playing this full of shit. I reckon we should go get an we should go get an off or something. It's hot. We could go try and find Sunny Boy. Remember them? No. Fucking dumb. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Like a frozen popper. You do. I don't remember them. Yes, you love them. Sunny Boy. <laughs> Maybe. Is it kind of purple and orange? Yeah, it's your favourite. I think I remember them. They weren't my favourite. Yeah, they were. Let's go find them. I'm sleeping about them the other day. I don't think they make it anymore. They would. You reckon? Yep, definitely. Yeah. Well, I can't leave here and I don't want an ice box. Why not? I'm waiting for my washing and I've got stuff soaking in nappy sand. Oh, wait. <laughs> no! It takes ages. My stuff has to be washed a few times. So, no. Oh, whatever. It's fucking hard. I have to listen to the news piece. Is it true that what Angela Bresnik is saying happened in the pool? She's lying. She just wants to be on current affair. Reg trained me the most. That's why I'm the one who knows it couldn't be true. It's so dumb when newspapers say stuff like that. When I was a kid, they said I was going to swim in the Olympics. Just because the newspaper says something, it actually means shit. Golden shit. And now, every day it's about Kitty Fiddler. <laughs> and it's like, remember teachers going on about stranger danger? That fucked me up. Sticker <laughs> <laughs> of the freaky dude with the evil eye? That was good as fuck. <laughs> I've always got my drainage apprenticeship. I know that, that was before. Yeah, only a few months ago. Then what? I'll probably get this work. That's good. I'll get heaps of money. I'll probably start my own business. Get a loan, interest rates low, and just plug my boss's clients off. He's a lazy rude fuck anyway, so it won't be wrong to take people away from him. That sounds good then. I want to get a car too. So yours? Yeah, might sell it up here. Probably get more up here. Someone might get you to help me. Where are you staying up here? I got a good place. I like it, I'm doing okay. Got a yard and everything. Where is it? I'm not going to tell you then. Why not? 
But I ain't around here no more. Well, you could come back to Golden, Shane. I'll protect you, eh? What if I need protecting from you? And you reckon you're safe now? Hey? Around here? A lot of weirdo. Oh, no. Shane, fuck. People are fucked up around here. There's like boy prostitutes and everything. That wall thing. Under the coke sign. It's not under the coke sign. It's the wall of the old jail. Oh, you know it, do you? No. People <laughs> might fuck you up, Shane. A homeless guy got scouts from vigilantes from Sutherland. That wanted all homeless people off the street. I sleep with the radio on some security, so I hear about all the news. It seems dodgy around here, but... I've never had any trouble. Yeah, well, I'm staying here. Can we get by? I'm getting by, okay. Let me finish my washing. Alright, so I should go then. Goodbye, Shane. Fuck off! Don't touch me! You're gonna look after yourself. You're just little and young. I call the police. I've seen the signs. It's a target of seatbelt. Stay away! <laughs> Tell mum and dad they're okay. No, just tell them to leave me alone. And now I'm moving on anyway. They won't be able to find me. Okay, should we shake hands away? See ya. Shane, you could come back, you know. Let go of my hand. Shane, come back. Let go of my hand. I want to get to know you again. Let go of my fucking hand. You're restless, Shane. I said let go, huh? <laughs> I want you. I want you, man. Get out. I need it. I don't need this anymore. Protect you couldn't find me. Never want to see you again. <laughs>